In the dimly lit mortuary of an old town, Carl, an undertaker with a taste for the peculiar, sought solace in the comforting haze of cannabis. The scent of the herb filled the air, mingling with the lingering aroma of embalming fluids and the musty embrace of death. As Carl exhaled a cloud of smoke, his senses heightened and he could feel the energy of the room shifting. The flickering candlelight seemed to dance with a newfound liveliness, casting eerie shadows upon the lifeless forms resting in their eternal slumber. Unbeknownst to Carl, his indulgence had awakened a dormant force within the mortuary, a force eager to partake in the euphoria of the herb. The spirit of a stoner, forever intertwined with the essence of cannabis, slowly materialized beside Carl, its translucent form mirroring his own. Startled yet intrigued, Carl offered the ethereal figure a joint, recognizing the shared love for the herb that bridged the gap between their worlds. As the stoner spirit accepted the offering, the room seemed to vibrate with an otherworldly energy, as if the boundaries between the living and the dead had momentarily blurred. With each puff, the ghostly figure became more corporeal, its features sharpening and its presence growing stronger. It spoke to Carl in whispers, recounting tales of past highs and the mysteries that lay beyond the veil of mortality. Together, they shared a bond that transcended the boundaries of life and death, finding solace in the shared experience of cannabis. The mortuary became a sanctuary where the stoner spirit could briefly rekindle the sensations of earthly indulgence, and Carl could explore realms beyond the mundane. But as the night wore on, a sense of unease settled upon Carl. He noticed a growing darkness within the stoner spirit, a hunger that went beyond mere enjoyment of the herb. The spirit's desires became insatiable, its presence increasingly malevolent. In a moment of clarity, Carl realized the true nature of his spectral companion, the stoner spirit once bound by its love for cannabis, had become a twisted entity, feeding off the life force of those who indulged in the herb. Carl had unknowingly unleashed a ravenous entity, trapped between realms, seeking to satisfy its unending craving. Fear gripped Carl's heart as he confronted the vengeful spirit. He pleaded for mercy, vowing to make amends for his unwitting role in its resurrection. But the spirit, fueled by its insatiable hunger, showed no mercy, its ethereal form contorting with a sinister delight. In a desperate act of self-preservation, Carl mustered all his courage and cast a spell he had learned from a forgotten grimoire. The words hung heavy in the air, invoking ancient forces to bind the spirit and banish it back to the netherworld. A whirlwind of energy enveloped the mortuary, crackling with supernatural power. The stoner spirit shrieked in agony as its spectral form dissipated, consumed by the very darkness it had spawned. Exhausted yet relieved, Carl stood amidst the dissipating energy, contemplating the consequences of his actions. The mortuary returned to its stillness, the scent of cannabis lingering in the air as a reminder of the dangers that could arise from tampering with supernatural forces. From that day forward, Carl vowed to respect the boundaries of life and death, forever changed by his encounter with the vengeful stoner spirit. The mortuary became a place of reflection, a reminder that even in the pursuit of pleasure, one must tread cautiously and be mindful of the forces that may be awakened. 